Hey, happy Sunday. What another gorgeous day in Chicago. Gosh. Um, what an exciting week it's been. You know, um, Thursday I went to go interview Tommy Two Tone at Martini Park and he's saying 8675309 Jenny. So that video is coming up. And then on Friday we did a video um, for Sarah's birthday party at Shay's Lounge. I don't know why that's hard for me to say, but it is. And, um, Jim Lasky was uh, fantastic, and we really had a great time. Um, so those two videos are coming up, and actually, you may be thinking, wow, Jen, your skills editing have uh, gotten fantastic when those videos come out. And that uh, might be because Ben Mahoney and I, uh, Ben is an amazing videographer and editor, and we're working together, and that's really exciting. So, um, yeah, if you're thinking that I got really good, it might be because... Uh, I didn't do it, <laughs> um, but I am really good, so let's keep that in mind. Um, I wanted to uh, go back the other day, the last time I did a vlog, I was talking to you about this book that I read, The Four Agreements, and um, I wanted to give you two more little sections in chapter two, so I, I am, we're just going to kind of give you a little book report, because I think it's such a great book, and um, you know, maybe you don't have time to read it, you just kind of want the Jen's notes, um, like Cliff's notes, but much shorter. <laughs> um, okay, the second chapter is called Being Impeccable with Your Word. And um, so the first, oh, I think I lost it. Boo! Okay, I found it. Yay! Um, the first one that I want to read to you. A sin is anything that you do which goes against yourself. Everything you feel or believe or say that goes against yourself is a sin. Self-rejection is the biggest sin that you can commit. Um, that's that's pretty deep, but I but I think incredibly true. I'm reminded of something that um, I heard Marianne Williamson say once, which is God doesn't make junk. So um, you know, to say that we're not good enough in one way or another, I mean, God doesn't make junk. So so. Uh, Let's not say that, right? You are fantastic. Um, the other thing that I want to read to you is they're kind of talking about white magic and black magic, but kind of putting spells. I mean, you know, it's it's a really interesting book the way that it's positioned. But um, so right now he's about to talk about white magic. Um, it's so funny because if my grandmother heard me, she'd think I'm talking about witchcraft. But it's it, it's a story. I mean, it's another way I think to look at universal truth. So I think it's a really good, I think it's a really good book. Check it out if you want to know more. Or you can just ask me. Um, so second quote, use the word to share your love. Use white magic beginning with yourself. Tell yourself how wonderful you are, how great you are. Tell yourself how much you love yourself. Use the word to break all those teeny tiny agreements that make you suffer. Now I know um, that was the second verse. I, you know, I know that uh, we see things on comedy shows and, you know, I, I like myself and, you know, all that stuff. But, you know, it's, I think it's really true. We, we have so much going on in our head, the little chatter that I think it's important that we really do say that those nice things to ourselves. I mean, you know, you may feel a little bit cheesy, but what's so noble about feeling bad? Like, where did we pick that up from? So stop suffering. You're great. And, um, you know, say little great things. I put little notes all, all around me to, uh, to remind me how, <laughs> how great I know. Um, all right. Well, have a great weekend and, um, Obama inaugurations coming up on Tuesday and that should be a party. We're going to uh, do another video there. So I'll talk to you soon. Bye.